Hi guys, Mikey and JJ are with you. And today, we are going to have a very interesting challenge. And as you may have noticed, we are in space today. And it is very cold here. But this is not the main problem. We must build space houses. And for that, we have chests of resources and different spheres. So for this, we have a roulette wheel. So we can choose who gets a chest with cool resources and who gets a bad one. So let's get going before we run out of time. And I hope you're ready for it. Okay, uh, come on. Spin this roulette wheel, and I hope I get a red sphere, because I'm red. And I want the color green, and something tells me that I won. And what kind of resources do I have in my chest? Um, it seems like you're out of luck. But I think you're already used to it, so don't get upset. And I have the coolest resources in my chest. And I'm not even surprised at that, because everyone knows that the strongest are lucky. I just don't understand why I was unlucky again. I'm already tired of building different buildings out of bad blocks. Don't worry. I think you're already used to it. So, let's build space houses already. I think this one will be fun, because you and I have never built in space before. So, what is this thing in the chest? It looks like a jetpack! Wow! This is really cool! I definitely didn't expect this, and I already really like it! But, I have not forgotten this injustice! I am constantly unlucky in these battles! Well, what can I tell you? The main thing is not to give up and do not get upset. Sooner or later, you will also get lucky. But I would advise you to just gather your thoughts and start building a space house. Or are you already going to give up and forget about it? I didn't even think about giving up. I'm actually ready to build a space house. But don't you think that a house made of wood and dirt in space will look strange? And anyway, I'm still not happy that you got the best blocks again. Mikey, you're thinking too much. Just calm down and build your space house because we have to do it in time. I would tell you that before the evening, but it's not clear that it's night or day. We don't even see the sun. What are you even saying? What kind of sun? What difference does it make if we're in space? Have you gone completely crazy there? Or what's wrong with you? I'm already tired of this, and I don't like it at all. I just want to build a space house. Mikey, I just wanted to tell you something. If you don't want to listen, then say so. But for some reason, you immediately start to be aggressive for some reason. Even though I didn't do anything to you. Just like you. I'm building a space house for myself. In which I will feel comfortable living. And you're busy with some nonsense. Then why did you even agree to go into space if you don't like it? You don't seem to quite understand what I was telling you. I said that I don't like this injustice. And you're talking about something else altogether. And I don't like this anymore. Just calm down. I'll build a house, even from bad materials. I won't give up. I'll succeed. And you keep doing this nonsense and hope that you will be able to win again just because you have better resources. Mikey, it doesn't matter which blocks. It doesn't matter. Even from a cobblestone, you can build something beautiful. And you're just looking for excuses for yourself. And that's bad. Because it's easier for you to admit that the battle is not honest than to try and build something cool. I even know what you're going to say now. And to be honest, I don't even want to listen to you. Because it doesn't make any sense. I wasn't going to make excuses. I know that this battle is unfair. Because you always come across cool blocks. And you're constantly busy mocking me. And I don't understand why you're doing this. I didn't do anything wrong to anyone. And I didn't want to do it. I always honestly participate in this challenge. And I can never win. And I think that I would definitely win if I had... There were blocks like yours. I know that. Mikey, while you were making excuses, I've already built an entire living room in my house. And you just stand there and do nothing. And then you will definitely lose this battle. So, it's better to try to do something than to do nothing at all. And talk about how unlucky you are. You just don't know how to lose. And you're afraid to admit it. But me and the audience, we know that you have no chance against me. Did you just tell me that you have a living room? It's cool. But you forgot that I don't have such blocks, televisions, and everything else that you have. I can't do anything like that even if I want to. And you're also mocking me because of this and trying to prove something to me that I'm wrong about it. 
You're it not serious now. I hope that everything will be fine and that it will end because I'm already tired of all this. Okay, think what you want. It seems you live in your own world and you don't understand the essence of your words. We have a battle between us now and we must not give up. We must fight each other. Well, not in terms of fighting, but I'm talking about who's cooler to build a space house. Do you understand that now? Of course it's all cool. But you forgot one fact. It's that this battle is unequal, okay? You have much better resources. And you have all kinds of TVs, ice cream and everything else. And I have only dirt, boards and glass. And that's it. I have nothing else. Do you understand me or not? And you think that you are the coolest because you build some... The mechanisms. Some kind of doors are cool. Isn't that right? But you forget that I can't do this. Not because I don't want to or can't, but because I just don't have the materials like you do. Oh, Mikey, how boring are you? Why don't you just want to build your space house? I do it, and I never complain that I'm missing something. I just take it and do it, and all you do is complain. And it's already starting to get boring. If you listen to yourself from the outside, then you wouldn't talk like that anymore, because it's just terrible. But I will not forbid you anything. You are lucky that we are in space and there is no one here. And I will listen to you better than the silence of space. Um, why did you tell me that now? Do you think that I am pleased to hear this from you? If you continue to say this, then at some point I will stop talking and you will not hear me anymore. And then do not cry and do not complain that you miss me because you are already boring me with this. So. Just build your doors already, or what are you building there? But though, I don't care about that. I'm busy with my very important business here, and I'm not up to you right now. Mikey, you should just look at my space house. It's very cool. I've never built this before, and I really like it. I'm happy with myself. But you're probably surprised that I didn't answer you. Is that right? So, I just don't care about you. And I think I'll need to help you a little bit, because you're generally relaxed. So, Mikey, meet the guests. I hope that you made me a cake or something like that. Oh my god, what are you up to? Hey, get out of my house. There's nothing of yours here. Do you understand? Are you kidding me? Or why are you doing this at all? I don't have anything anyway, and you're also breaking down my house. I don't understand. Are you jealous of me, or why are you doing this at all? Please just get away from here, don't bother me. I want to be happy, and I don't want my house to be broken. JJ, let's agree that you won't break my house for me, okay? Mikey, I'm helping you. Don't you see this, or do I still need to explain it to you? Let me make traps in your house better. I think you'll definitely like this. The main thing is, don't get upset and don't do anything about it. Now your house is at least a little like a house, and I hope that you will already finish with this circus and give up. You understand that I have done more in your cosmic house than you, and you still think that your bad luck is to blame for everything. I don't need your help. Let me help you, just like you helped me. Hey, why did you close the door? What's wrong with you? Are you afraid of me? Come on, open the door. I'll help you. I'll break something for you too. I think you need help breaking the TV too. Or your mechanism that closes the doors? Or are you already? Are you afraid of me? And you're not as cool as you used to be? You're starting to disappoint me. I thought you were braver, but you turn out to be a loser. Mikey, calm down. You've become kind of nervous, and I don't like it at all, okay? I just helped you, and you wanted to break something for me here. And why would I open my doors for you? So I think there's no need. So, do something useful and don't touch me. I'm busy decorating my space house here, but I'm thinking about something right now. And I don't really like it. What will we do if some asteroid or something worse arrives at us? JJ, I'm asking you to calm down because I can't stand it anymore. You're constantly talking about some nonsense. So, please, take care of your house already and don't talk about all sorts of asteroids and worse because I'm already having a hard time here. So let's get this over with for now, because it's not funny, because you can survive the disaster, and I can't, and that's what I'm already, I don't like it, and I would like to live longer, even in a house like this. I hope you heard me. Who 
are you talking to there anyway? Do you think that someone is listening to you? But I have to disappoint you. No one here takes you seriously at all. So it's better to just shut up and not draw attention to yourself until I want to deal with you myself. Don't bother me. The main thing is that you should understand that I'm busy here, working out a plan to defeat you and destroy you. And I know perfectly well that you're thinking about it too. But I can warn you that you won't succeed. So don't waste your time on this nonsense. And anyway, don't even think about it. So that everything would be okay with me. Hmm, you're so funny. I, I'm listening to you and I can't believe my ears. You're seriously thinking that you can beat me. But you won't succeed. You're just wasting my time and your time on all sorts of nonsense. And I don't understand why you're doing this and what you're trying to do to achieve this. Everyone already understands that I have much more opportunities to win. And I am much smarter and stronger than you. And I also have something that you do not have. Okay. I'm tired of all this. I'm tired of playing these games with you. Now it's time to talk to you seriously. Because you don't understand ordinary words. So come on. Come here. Or not. Let's better I'll come to you to destroy you. I think this is the best option of all those that can be possible. And you don't bother me. Otherwise, you'll die. I warned you. And you didn't listen to me. So you get what you deserve. And don't you dare blame me for this. Because everyone knows that I'm the best of us. Not you. So you lost the first battle. But this is just the beginning. So accept it. You will lose more than once. Do what you want. I don't care about you anymore. Because I've come up with something cooler than your home. Or what are you doing there anyway? I've already managed to build the defense of my space home, and I'm already starting to build something really cool. You'll like it. The main thing is, don't look here, because it's a gift. And go where you were going. Go get your resources in your cave. Or what are you even up to? I don't care anymore. So just leave me alone, okay? Oh, do whatever you want. Do you think you can scare me? But no, don't even hope for it. I have a very cool chunk with a cool cave. So I will have a lot of resources unlike you. So I do not even know how you will fight with me when I make myself a diamond armor. I even feel sorry for you. But you keep building some defensive structures in the hope that it will save you. But I can upset you. It won't help. I wouldn't say that. But it seems like I did something wrong. So if it doesn't work, then I just forgot how to do it. And don't blame me for that. And how will your armor help you? Do you really think I'm going to be scared of that? But no, you didn't guess it at all. So just do what you want, but don't mess with me. Because you can't get closer to me than a shot. Don't even try to do it. I won't let you do it. I hope you understand that, and okay? Wait, what are those sounds? Oh my God, it didn't seem to me. Or are there creepers everywhere? But these are some unusual creepers, and I don't like it anymore. Have you even seen them? Are they weird? And what should we do with them? It seems to me that we will not kill them, and they will try to blow up our houses. But something tells me that they won't be able to blow up my house for anything. And I'm glad of that. I don't like it at all anymore. I'm afraid of them. These creepers didn't just appear near our houses. And sooner or later, they'll just destroy my house because it's wooden. But I don't want to die. JJ, please do something with them because I don't even have any weapons. I can't do anything to them. I know that you had weapons there besides resources and blocks, so use them. Oh my God, Mikey. I see how many of them there are in this. And it looks very scary from the outside. But you hold on. I'll handle the creepers that are near my house and I'll definitely help you. Okay? I hope that we both survive today as and everything will be fine with us. Because it's not as easy as you think. I have a weapon, but it's not really effective against these unusual creepers. Do you understand me? Come on, JJ. Go fight them. And I'll keep an eye on you and you can handle him. I'm sure I'm looking at you and I'm already getting scared of this. So go to him and defeat him, okay? He's on top. So come on, I'll watch so that everything would be fine with you, and I will tell you, if something is unclear to you, I hope that you will cope with it. Okay, I get you, 
Thank you for your support. Now I'll deal with him. He's not as cool as he used to be and he no longer has a chance to survive. I guarantee him that. Well, aren't you as cool as you used to be? How do you like me now? Or did you not expect this? But alas, you can't get away from here anymore. You're going to die here now. You shouldn't have decided to come here at all. I will take revenge on you for all that you have done. So don't even think that you will live. You are now doomed to die. And I will make sure that you do not get out of here alive. And do not doubt. I will keep my word. Do you understand me? JJ, thank you so much. If you hadn't saved me, I probably wouldn't have survived. They just destroyed my space house. And it turns out that you won because your house survived. Mikey, don't worry. I think if I was in that situation, you'd do the same. So I did what I had to do. Guys, like and subscribe to the channel. And thank you for watching. And don't forget to leave your comments. And now I'm going to destroy this house.